Hello everyone, how are you guys doing today? My name is Saris and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be reacting to no McDonald laughing at inappropriate things. So without any delays, let's get to it. Here we go. Here, Adam, do a joke. <laughs> All right. Uh, a good name for a dog is Syndrome. That uh, then when he tries to attack someone, you can tell you can yell Down Syndrome. Uh, <laughs> don't laugh. Right. <laughs> it's not. I, I mean, it's. You know, <laughs> That's like it a was joke. a little insensitive, I guess. <laughs> and, uh, some of the 200 Nigerian schoolgirls kidnapped by extremists in Nigeria have been forced to marry their kidnappers. And uh, worse than that, they've been forced to laugh at their husband's stories uh, even after hearing them for the umpteenth time. Uh, you know something. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's but very yeah, hard to, to make a joke about those girls who are kidnapped. <laughs> when I hear about those things, that, it's that is one of the worst. You know, and yet you got a big laugh on yeah, yours. Yeah, I'm sorry, I, I got it. Now, as an old-timey broadcaster, do you have other old-timey broadcaster friends? Well, they did. They're, they're <laughs> Mike Wallace was a great friend. Mike was a grand guy. I said, he had dementia at the end. And that, that's funny to you, huh? You know, McDonald, I want to tell you. No, it's a very odd thing to say. If you're looking, if you're looking, to broaden your horizons, I don't think it's worth <laughs> to no. laugh no, because at someone who had dementia. I'm not laughing at that. I'm laughing at that you said. Uh, <laughs> he was you the best. Just said I loved him. Mike it was Wallace sad. was a great guy. He had he dementia. <laughs> it has heavy uh, duty grilling grates. I know that. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You think the grilling grates are flimsy? No. No, they're heavy-duty grilling grates. They deliver exactly what you need to achieve when you need to achieve that perfect steakhouse flavor. Why are you laughing? You're making a mockery out of the man <laughs> grates. I'm nice. pretending I know who Albert Gray is. I didn't. No, no, Albert Fish. Oh. You're a New Yorker. So anyways, he was a child rapist and cannibal, as I explained. What the fuck? When he's a child Jesus rapist, you try not to laugh when he looks at you. Oh, so. come on, man. <laughs> It's not funny. I know it's not, but I know, you, but I know you want people to laugh. Fish chose his victims. He only chose victims who were either mentally handicapped. Now, don't laugh at this. <laughs> Please. You know he wants you to, right? No. That's you the big, yeah. Next part. Okay. And I'm not Fish chose victims who were either mentally handicapped or African-American. Oh, come on. <laughs> Why would you think that's funny? God damn, Fred. <laughs> it's just inappropriate. Fred, that was the worst part of the story. But why do you think he did that? What would be the explanation? Why would he only attack... Why, why would his victims that he chose only be either mentally handicapped or African Americans? Because people oh, fuck. don't, in those days, didn't care when those people were vanished. That's, That's You're right. thinking like right. Albert Fish now. <laughs> and prostitutes. That's what he... That's right. Prostitutes. Exactly. That's right. That's Nobody really I mean. cares no. about prostitutes. Well, but you're exactly right. That's why Albert Fish killed only mentally handicapped <laughs> and <laughs> African Americans. What about... I thought you'd laugh at African Americans again. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I, I Why am I laughing? I know he'll do something. That's, that's outrageous. How oh, it's kind of outrageous. Man. Hey, for the ninth consecutive year, uh, Nick, JetBlue Air, Airlines rank first for satisfaction among all North American airlines. But you know what ranked least in satisfaction? 9-11 Airlines. <laughs> what a terrible name for an airline. It reminds me of that tragedy. <laughs> oh, 9-11. <laughs> yeah, no. I uh, don't laugh at 9 11. What? 9 11. <laughs> I am as bad as them! <laughs> I tried to tell him not to go, laugh. Adam? I know. I walked through blood and bones in the streets of Manhattan trying to find my brother. Jesus. Yeah, he was in northern Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to hear my impression of the That's nine? It's going to be you if you don't lose weight. Do you want to hear my impression of the nine eleven call from Johnny Carson? Nine one one call. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah. But nine eleven was a national tragedy. Yes, it was. Why do you laugh at that? <laughs> you said he. No, it works. Okay, Johnny Carson died at eighty years old. Would you like to hear my impression? <laughs> 
<laughs> Were you in New York when the Twin Towers fell? No, I was uh, in uh, Los Angeles. Well, either way, it was a national tragedy. <laughs> what the fuck? Why am I laughing? It was. I, yeah, I know. 9-11. <laughs> 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 We're gonna go to hell. No shit. <laughs> so, that was no McDonald laughing at inappropriate things, and I think the description is bang on on this, because every guest and every individual that appeared in this video was laughing at an absolute inappropriate things, but. So was I. So I am as bad as they are, or I understand what it is that it's just fucking comedy. Just the fucking word 9-11 had me laughing, losing my head over it. Because it is a fucking tragedy, and yet, every time he just said the word 9-11, everybody lose their shit for no other reason except. Because Norm is such a brilliant at just saying things out of the blue, and people just laugh because it's just... The way Norm tells a joke or the way he talks is just absolutely brilliant. And laughing at <laughs> uh, African American bit for no reason. And I was laughing along with him. I was just like, why the fuck am I laughing? It's really not fucking. It's nothing. It's just. He just keeps saying. He's literally just keeps saying African American. And that's it. And it was laughing. It was just so funny, man. I loved every single second of it. And the very first joke. Uh, calling your dog uh, syndrome so whenever he go uh, try to bite somebody you can say down syndrome that was an appropriate shit man but it cracked me up i don't know why maybe because i do appreciate a bit of inappropriate things because if it is funny it's funny you know what i mean so what i hope you enjoyed this as much as it uh, as i did because i really fucking did if you did like subscribe share and leave a comment also follow me on instagram and twitter uh, links are in the description below i'll see you guys next time